It may be a song, flowers, or candy, but Valentine's Day comes in many different shapes and sizes, even for those who don't have a Valentine. This year it's not a burden to feel single because I've been in, in relationships and I, I guess it's this time in my life is like a time for me just like to take time to find out who I am. Part of that time Marina spent finding out who she was today came at the St. Mary's Catholic Center in Aggieland as a contestant on a radio show dating game. We've got St. Patrick's Day, that's where you get drunk. We got St. Valentine's Day, that's where you're supposed to fall in love. Well, why not fall in love on the air? The Catholic Guy radio show on Sirius XM Radio took eight Catholic Aggies, four girls and four guys. One of the guys chose from three of the girls, while one of the girls picked from three of the other guys. But not before they asked them questions, even though they couldn't see each other. In this case, it's like I'm you know, getting to know you after like 15 minutes and then asking you on a date, so it's uh, definitely something different. The show gave each pair $100 for their dates tonight, and they must report back tomorrow. And while they might be single now, science suggests it would be best for their heart health if these become full-blown relationships. The security that comes from knowing there's somebody there for you at all times, um, it, the lack of stress from knowing that there's somebody in your life that takes a genuine concern if you're happy. And after being picked, Marina was. It was interesting to broaden my horizons and meet new, new people. 